Are you applying for one of the two-room flexi flats in the August 2021 BTO this time round? Then you need to watch this video because I will go through all the two-room flexi types in this August BTO launch and walk through the analysis with you so that you don't have to. What's up guys, it's Christopher from Honey Money SG and in this channel, we are all about building financial knowledge, teach money saving hacks and also help you lead a fulfilling quality of life. So if you haven't watched my earlier videos on the BTO reviews and analysis of this August 2021 BTO, do check them out in my playlist where I go through all of the project sites right here. But in this video, I will just go through all the two room flexi types in detail because it addresses to a very specific group of people who want to apply for two-room flexi flats. Now, if you are a single above 35 and you want a new flat instead of a resale flat, you can only go for a two-room flexi because if you want to buy a BTO that's three rooms, four room or even five room, you need to have a family nucleus. Or let's say if you have a foreign spouse and you want to apply for a new flat, then you can only buy a new flat under the two-room flexi with a non-citizen housing scheme. Or let's say you are a senior citizen and you are looking to increase your retirement funds and downsizing your existing flat. You can also apply for the two-room flexi with a shorter term lease so that number one, you can sell off your existing flat to free up the excess cash for your retirement fund. And number two, when all your children have grown up and move out of that house, you may want a smaller place for easier maintenance. So these are the specific target groups that the two-room flexi is suitable for. And now let's go on to each of the projects that are offering two-room flexi flats in this August 2021 BTO. Let's go. Alright, so going on to the August 2021 sales launch build to order, we can easily see that which are the projects that are offering two-room flexi types, namely Haogang Citrine, Colvin Wellspring, Tampines Green Quartz, and Toguan Grove. Just these four projects are offering the two-room flexi flats. So I'll open each of them and then go through what are the specifics. Okay, regarding the site plan and the pictures, I already gone through in a separate video. So take a look at those videos where I went through the unit types and site map. For two room flexi types, I just want to go through the important thing, which is the price and the floor plan. Okay, so starting with Haogang Citrine, two room flexi type one, floor area 40 square meters, internal floor area 38 square meters with a price range of 108k to 128k. If we look at the resale flats nearby, there's really no comparison because no resale flats in two-room flexi. But let's take a look at the layout plan. So internal floor area 38 square meters as you walk in from the main door, kitchen on your left, household shelter on your right. So a fairly small living compartment, you have one toilet and your bedroom is attached to your living and dining room. And then you can just put a single small dining table right here. So very small compartment suitable for one or two persons. And for Haogang Citrine, you can even opt for an optional component scheme OCS package for $6,200. So that includes your lighting, window grills, built-in kitchen cabinets with hoop and hop and even the kitchen sink tap and all that kitchen stuff right you can even have a built-in wardrobe water heater mirror and toilet roll holder in the bathroom so like condo already they already help you build all the stuff that you need okay let's move on to flexi type 2 for haogang c trim estimated floor area 48 square meters internal floor area 46 square meters price range between 130k to 156k okay again no comparison to resale flats and let's take a look at the layout ideas this time all right so for this type 2 flexi it's like slightly bigger at 46 square meters internal floor area so once you enter from the main door you can see this kitchen on your left household shelter on your right you have a toilet that is over here and then you have your living room and your bedroom attached here now with a dining table in a separate compartment so the difference between type 1 and type 2 is you have this additional space which you can use for your study or your dining area or you can even make into a separate compartment move. that means you put a partition here like they say it's an optional folding door for shop lease so you can just pull up a partition and a door here and it becomes another room so especially for elderly if you need a long-term care helper staying in then this will be the room for the helper and there's also optional component scheme package for the two-room flexi type 2 at $7,380 so same thing, it includes all the built-in furnishings, lighting and water heater stuff that you need for fundamental basic furnishing and renovation. So they do this up all for you for $7,380. It's quite a good price, especially if you don't have to factor in your time spent looking for contractors to build up your unit. Okay, that's it for Haogang Citrine. Let's move on to the next project, Coven Wellspring. So for Coven Wellspring, let's take a look at the price for two-room flexi type 1. Estimated floor area 38 
38 square meters, estimated internal floor area 36 square meters, price range between 153k to 181k. Let's take a look at the floor plan. So this is the type 1 floor plan. As you enter from the main door, same thing, you have kitchen on your left. This time the household shelter is a bit further, just right opposite your single toilet. And then the living room and the bedroom at the end of the unit. And if we move to the bottom, it's essentially the same thing, it's just that this one is with floor finishes. Now we move on to Flexi Type 2 for Coven Wellspring, this time it's a bit more expensive, 203,000 to 234,000 for internal floor area 46 square meters. And let's take a look at the layout and the floor plan, so this time you walk in, kitchen on your left, also shelter with the water closet, this time your toilet a bit different, you have this separate compartment for a shower screen, and like all Type 2s, you have this additional compartment space which you can use for your dining table, home office or even a separate compartment room as depicted in the second picture here the additional bedroom that you can use for your helper but otherwise all the remaining things of flexi type 2 remains the same the layout is almost similar to what we have in the haogang c3 with that let's move on to the third project offering the two room flexi which is tampanese green quartz and let's take a look at the two room flexi type 1 so internal floor area 38 square meters price range 142k 264k layout ideas why this is for the 38 square meters internal floor plan this time kitchen is on your right after the main door household shelter just right opposite the toilet and then living room and dining room with the bedroom attached so very similar for all the flexi type 1 there isn't much of a change in terms of the organization and layout of flexi type 1 because they are mostly the same size and there's really not much orientation you can change okay if you look at the flexi type 2 internal floor area this time is slightly bigger at 47 square meters between price of 165 to 196 thousand square meters and if we look at the floor layout okay this time is slightly different already once you enter the main door household shelter is on your left toilet is on your right not the kitchen right so now this time the kitchen is put up in this area it is a slightly larger kitchen with an l-shaped format so if you prefer a larger cooking space you can choose the tampani screen quartz flexi type 2 likewise the living and dining area is attached to the bedroom so it's a fairly small area uh, but you have a separate compartment as usual for your helper or you want to set up a home office or dining table you can put it right here for more additional space of course with that optional folding door for short lease okay for the optional component scheme of tempering screen quartz is slightly more expensive at $7,420 because of the one additional square meters I guess it's for the bigger kitchen space they need to put in the additional cost for the flooring and the tiles with that let's go on to the last BTO project offering two room flexi which is Toguang Grove so for Toguang Grove for the two room flexi type 1 here is what we have 36 square meters internal floor area price range between 121 to 146 thousand singapore dollars and let's take a look at the layout okay no surprises for the flexi type one kitchen on your right household shelter opposite your toilet with the aircon latch okay long walkway leading to your living room and dining room attached with the single bedroom okay no difference from the top and the bottom picture only the floor finishes and then let's take a look at flexi type two right internal floor area 46 square meters price range 154 to 189 thousand dollars and let's go through the floor plan for flexi type 2 so this is quite similar to tampanese green quartz right you have your household shelter and your water closet just right at the entrance and then you have a slightly larger l-shaped kitchen where you can put in more kitchen appliances and cabinets for better cooking space and then with the bedroom and living dining room attached together with a separate compartment that you can use for your work study area or for your helper and put in the optional folding door for short lease. So most of the two room flexi types layout are very similar, maybe have a different orientation. But what's interesting for Togon Grove is that you see they have different optional component scheme. You can choose from package one, package two, or package three. So package one is like just pure flooring, vinyl strip flooring. And for package two is sanitary fitting. So that is your wash basin and your shower set and then for package 3 is more for renovation really so you see like lighting window grills built-in kitchen cabinets with hood and the hob kitchen sink tap and dish drying rack you have a built-in wardrobe as well with water heater mirror and toilet roll holder laminated upvc folding door for the flexible space so i hope next time hdb also introduce this kind of package 3 to the three room four room and five room flat lovers right because this is really very convenient you don't have to look for interior designers and contractors anymore and maybe get upset sell in the interior design package good for people who want a no frills concept right with that let me go on to the pricing of the august 2021 bto for two room flats here i already put in all the pricing the minimum 
and the maximum price of each project Haogang Citrine, Kowom Wellspring, Templin Screen Quartz and Toguan Grove. Now the medium price is derived by the middle price between the mean and the max or you can just call it average price in this case. And as you know HDB you need to pay a 10% down payment so what's remaining is the 90% amount that you need to loan. Of course this amount will differ from people to people because of enhanced housing grants and of course additional fees like buyer stamp duty, conveyancing fee and lawyer fees. Otherwise if you have a huge CPF account balance you can also make a huge down payment to reduce your loan. Now once you get the amount that you want to loan you can then go to HDB calculator already put in here and how much you need to loan depends on which project you want to go for. Let's say I want to go for Coven Wellspring and the two room flex C which is the most expensive project out of all this alright I need to loan $197,000 and let's see how much installment that takes. So I go on to this HDB calculator monthly installment and then I put in loan amount $197,000 Okay, I don't need for a repayment period 25 years, that's the max. And then interest rate of loan, I use 2.6% which is the CPF loan rate. And that gives me an estimated monthly installment of $894. So I'll just put in this $894 in this monthly installment. That's how much I need to pay per month. And let's say if you want to use your 100% CPF OA to pay the monthly installment, that means you don't need any cash top up. Then you'll know that from my CPF OA strategy video right here, that 23% of your monthly income goes into your ordinary account. So simply say, if your monthly income can derive enough ordinary account contribution to cover the monthly installment, then you don't need any cash top out, right? So it's just a very simple math formula. We just take 894, divide by 0.23 to get the amount of income that we need to cover the ordinary account contribution, which is 3,900 Singapore dollars of monthly income. So let's say if you're a single Singaporean above the age of 35 and you're making above a monthly income of 3.9k Singapore dollars, or even if you multiply that monthly income by 12 to become 47,000 Singapore dollars, then you can easily say that you can well afford this Coburn Wellspring 2 room flexi type 2 BTO because your monthly OA contribution is enough to cover $894 of the monthly installment and then you don't need any cash outlay. But just take all these numbers as guideline because different people have different circumstances and different housing grants available to them. So you have to do your own calculation to make sure that you can comfortably afford the monthly installment and make sure you don't over leverage, right? So I hope all this calculation has helped you and just comment a thank you if you found this useful. I greatly appreciate it and let's get back to the video. Alright, so I hope all the Doom Flexi analysis has helped you decide which project you want to go for. And here is a subscription rate for the Two Room Flexi Flats as of today's edit date. If you like the content and found value today, please help click the like button. And also consider subscribing to my channel because I will have more housing and property content coming up. My name is Christopher, this is Honey Money SG, steering young adults to financial independence.